Hey everyone, my name is Samuel Boulanger and I'm a technical specialist for Microsoft. In this quick video, I want to show you how Dynamics 365 Guide and HoloLens can help you create, collaborate, and learn using mixed reality. I'll show you how you can improve quality and efficiency of the work done by your employees by bringing data and information in the physical context of their work and how you can empower all employees by bringing new technologies and drive data transformation with first-line workers. Now, let's get to it. So now I'm in my Dynamics 365 guide application. I can open the menu by looking at my N and select the list of the different guides available to me. So my first choice is to select from a list of available guide. And the second one is to leverage the field service integration. So there's an integration showing me all the work orders assigned to me in Dynamics 365 field service, uh, which has a guide assigned to one of the tasks included in the work order. In that case, I need to repair uh, air compressor head. So I can select the work order and it will automatically bring me to the proper guide to complete the task. First step will be to, um, to align with the anchor. So I have a picture there showing me where the anchor is on the, the equipment. So we'll make sure that all my holograms are well aligned. So in that case, it's well aligned. So I click on confirm and then it bring me to the first step of my guide. I can navigate between the different steps by gazing at the button like this. Then it's telling me that it will teach me how to reinstall the compressor head. That's perfect. Next. And now you can notice this big yellow and black uh, electric icons that's telling me to make sure that the compressor is unplugged. So you can leverage different type of holograms with different colors, textures and animations to make sure to bring the attentions of your resources and technicians to specific places uh, around your equipment. Now I've made sure that it was properly unplugged, so I can move to the step three by either gazing at the button or using the voice recognition. Next step. Now it's telling me to install the cylinder bolt. Uh, so I have this hologram telling me where to put the part. If I follow the dotted line, I it's bring me to the, the part and I have this an hologram telling me to pick it up. So I'll just pick it up and put it in the right place. Now I'll move to step four, which tell me now to put back the head in place. Again, I can follow the dotted line and you can notice that the different hologram like the hand uh, and the other hologram are from a different color and texture. Now I'm not sure which side I should put this, uh, this head. So I can look at this, a quick video showing me how to properly place the head. Okay, so it's this side. So I'll just put it on top of the cylinder bowl like this and then move to the next step. Now it's telling me to install the four screws on the four corners and what you see there, those screw hologram are, are very, um, uh, uh, very easy to create custom holograms that I use uh, using paint, paint 3D. Um, so it's telling me to put the four screws. So I'll just pick up the screw and insert them in the four corner. There we go. And then move to the step six which tell me to pick up a Phillips screwdriver so I can follow the dotted line. And now I won't have to use the voice recognition or the button to move to uh, the step seven. I just have to pick up the screwdriver. It will automatically detect that I've picked it up and move me to step seven. Now I just have to screw the four screws. I'll just do the first one and move to the step eight. It's telling me to put back in place the fill pipe. I'm not sure how, so I'll just look at the video. 
Okay, it's fairly easy. So I'll just do the same. I need to insert it there, pick up the fill pipe, gently tighten it, and then move to the step nine, which tell me to pick up a wrench. There we go. And tighten the fill pipe. I'm done. And I'm done with the head replacement for this compressor. Now I can use the integration with Power Apps and by looking at this button to the bottom right it will open a quick survey built on top of Power Apps that the technician will be able to fill to know how it went with the specific guide. So it's just loading. And what's great with Power App, it's it's really designed. I, I've been able to design this specific Power App to be able to easily use it using uh, HoloLens. As you can see, that's really easy to use, and I can even input text. Great experience, and that's it. And then I can submit the survey and I'm done. I can close the survey and move to the last step. And we're done. We've just completed the guide. So as you can see, um, it really helped a technician to do any types of um, manual tasks around equipment or even learning uh, by simply follow videos an hologram and step uh, while still having his entries. Thank you for watching. If you want to know how to move forward with mixed reality, please reach out to your Microsoft representative. I also put a useful link in the video description. If you have any question, don't hesitate to ask. Thank you.